What is going on guys? This is Spining Fatty and I'm here with a little congratulatory video to Optic Gaming who ended up winning MLG X Games. Actually just X Games brought to you by MLG. I don't know what the heck it was. All I know is Call of Duty was at the X Games and that was awesome. So my boys, Optic Gaming, I wore the Optic jersey. Whoa, I don't know how that happened. Anyways, I wore the Optic jersey just because they won. I'm very proud of the Optic boys. I'm also proud of the guys right here. TK, I, you know, I picked them not to even come out of their bracket. I was so wrong. This is the first time I have not picked them to place top three. And I wish I would have because I would have looked brilliant. But they did an amazing job. We're going to talk a little bit about the stats because I love the stats. This is brought to you by COD Esports TV. They provide all the stats that I ever use because they are awesome. Optic went four win or blah, 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 won four matches. Wow, I can't say that. Four four match wins. Um, they didn't lose a single matchup, which is awesome. You know, they, I'm proud of them. What's even a more amazing statistic is they went five and zero oh in S and D. That's, that's just amazing. No other team did as well. 1.25 KD in SND, which they tied with Strictly Business, who played only 28 rounds. Optic played 47 rounds. Now, the best player for KD in Search and Destroy was Fizzerp. 2.27. Fizzerp, you god, you. Great job. I, I need to start playing like some S&D tourneys and actually not suck because I want to have that KD. But guess who the second best player was? Nade Shot, 1.75 KD. That's just amazing. He got first blood 20% of the time. Actually, it was just under 19.15. Um, actually, and Fizzer 21.43. That dude it was just a god. He was the Zeus of SND this weekend and I wouldn't be surprised if you see a team maybe pick him up Miyagi was right under nade shot at 1.64 and then the Tash under him at 1.5 so great play out of those guys now as far as player ranks let's go ahead and look at overall KD attach owned that one 1.28 followed by optic scumpy Seth Abner averaged 1.21 with kills per round at around 26.42. And then in Blitz, his KD was 1.21 as well as Domination. So actually maybe, I'm sorry, 1.12 in Domination and 1.53. It was Apathy who had 1.21 for Blitz and Domination, 1.13 overall. Then Aix, Gunjar, TP, they're all up there. It was a great weekend, I think, for just about every team. To, to me, you know, I thought Evil Geniuses were going to win, and I thought Optic Gaming was going to come in second. Everybody, I got roasted by some people in my last video for saying that, saying, oh, you're an Optic fanboy. But no, they were strong, man. Like, if you've just watched them recently, you can tell something has clicked something is different and we saw that what i did not see was tk they came out of the blue for me and blew off the doors envy i'm surprised they didn't put up a little bit more of a fight thought they had had it in them and evil geniuses man i you know they just got shut down they got demoralized um i'm really surprised to see them come back and win the bronze because it just you know, TP had an interview. It didn't look like he was himself. But, uh, yeah, I I'm saying, like, as far as confidence. I, I, I don't know. But anyways, another shout-out to Optic Gaming. Congratulations, Mr. Hex. You are a legend, and I hope great things are to come. Make sure you check them out going into Anaheim. I can't wait for to make some previews. It's... It's about 10 days away, or uh, let's see, 11 days away, something like that. I'm going to be down there. If you see me, come say hi. I'll probably be wearing some like shirt and tie. I'll have an SB hat with a smiting fatty on it. Something will say smiting fatty on me, or you'll just see a short fat guy with a goatee in a suit or something. 
So make sure you say hi to me if I don't put out another video before then, which I will. Anyways, guys, love you. We'll see you later. Bye.